Sup? This is Alex Chu coming at you with another episode. This episode I want to talk about foodie call. Okay, not booty call, but foodie call. You know, like women, they they date you because they want you to take them out to uh, nice restaurants, you know, fancy restaurants. And basically they're dating you for the food, not for you, you know. Yeah, um, but before I talk about that, I want to tell you my name is Alex Shu. I'm the guy who invented physical mortality rings. These are rings that you put on your small fingers during sleep. You wear them, you don't age anymore. You become physically immortal. For example, I'm already 53. If you look at me, I'm pretty skinny, right? You don't see any... You don't see any beer belly on me, right? See? Really smooth. So I don't work out. You can tell, right? If you go to my website, livemuchlonger.com, I have lots of testimonials from Amazon customers. Most of them give me four star, five star. If you're interested, you want to look like me when you're 53, live much longer, I'll come, live much longer, I'll come, link is at the bottom of this video. Yeah, today I'm going to show you a clip, okay? You know, this guy uh, brought this, it's, a, it's on the second date, this guy brought a girl home, and the girl refused to eat his cooking. Okay, I'll show you a clip, and then we will come back, and I'll talk more about it, okay? So y'all tell me what's so bad about me deciding to cook a home cooked meal for my girl. No, no, no. everything She's is bad about this. I, uh, yes, I'm upset because it's our upset. second day. So what? I expected you to take me to the Capitol Grill. And we will go to the Capitol when? Grill Which, when? on Obviously, another day. Not, we went out last. Day. We no, went out last. Keep his word. I have more. Where should you take me out and do more? For I'm keeping my word. word. No, you're I, you not haven't keeping even your word. You haven't. No, you're not. You don't even I'm know that yet. No, this. No, listen. You see this? This I see is, it. This it's amazing. It looks amazing. It looks amazing. It looks black, brown, crusty, dusty. It musty, looks like you just want. I'm about to be on some real murder shit, eh? Something to complain about to me. It's not that I want something to complain about, but I expect you to stick by your word. I like, am sticking on. by my this word. Second, no, this is our second day. Exactly. So how do you know? We're not going, girl, and we're not going. How do you know that though? Because I'm here. What do you mean? I no, and you need to stay off that crack, man. Get out. No. Okay. Yeah. I appreciate you the effort of you cooking, right. but I wanted to go out with you. I want to have And fun. we will, but I wanted okay. to cook for you. No, I want to show I, you that I want to show you versatility. Oh my, it's okay. easy for me I, to take you out. This is too no. Yes, it's no. easy for me to take you out. Okay, it's easy for It takes a lot more thought to cook for somebody, right? That's all I'm saying. I do not want this. You hear me? I don't want this. I expect more from you. And that's that. Like, come on. So you wait until I cook up this meal just for you to decide. So that I you didn't know you just gonna I told I you we were coming in my house. What did you think? I was thinking that we're going to the Capitol the Grill. And like, we will go there about? eventually. But tonight you're at David's house eating my dinner. The, so that means what? That you I do not keep you. your word, right? I do that keep my word. You do not keep your word. How do I? If I didn't keep my word, why would if I didn't keep no, my word, how would I cook you? Don't have now? it. Just say you don't have it. I absolutely and have it. Actually, <laughs> tell me and have me expect. Maybe okay. I don't have it at all. I'm mean, gonna cook some cute for her. She might like it. No, but you you have to come over here expecting we're going somewhere and we're not actually going. I don't like that. I don't. I can have do more for me than what you want to eat. No. Well, come guess on. what? Guess what? No, You're with I, me right now. No, okay. I'm with you right you, now. Yes, exactly. we are on a date right now. Exactly. They didn't I'm make the cut, right and now, I did. Right? I'm with you right they now. They must not did something right. I never, I didn't lie to you about anything. Yes, you did. No, you I talked, didn't. Talked. You told me we were going to the Capitol Grill. Are and we will go to the Capitol Grill. But what I decided is? to cook for you this time. I need you to stick by your word. I, and I no, do. You're not. I always no, you're stick not. by my word. No, you're not. No, no, you are not. You were just over here complaining. You haven't even had one bite of this food. I don't want to have You one. haven't even, you yeah, haven't even I taken one bite out of it. To have wow. Food. I expected more. You shouldn't yeah. be expecting stuff so early on. I, you shouldn't be lying to me so early on. I don't I didn't lie. I didn't lie to you. I didn't, me so I, didn't lie to, I didn't lie about you anything. Know, I'm here for a reason, right? This is the second day. I'm here for a reason, right? I'm you, here for a reason, yeah, right? Because okay, you so want to be here. to go to the Capitol, the grill. Okay? I wow. wanna go out. I don't wanna say in. Okay, you should have told me that. You should communicate. I communicated I mean, like with you. Like too, like these y'all exactly. don't communicate. Y'all wanna say that y'all have so much y'all don't. I can really just pull up and take you where I need to go for well, well, It's an evil world we live in. You're, You're ungrateful. Boss. You're false. You probably just... Forget it. Just, okay. you know what? Yeah, just forget it. Just okay. give me my food back. Uh, you? Yeah, give me my food Here. back. I will Here cook it for food. another woman. That she will be appreciative. Because you oh, know what? You ain't the woman for me. Right. I'm going to have to be going Yeah, right. yeah. You yeah. do that. You do okay. that. Yeah, see and see. Do you know why the girl doesn't want to eat his food? Here's why. The girl is dating this man not because she wants to eat his food. The girl is dating this man because she wants to go to different restaurants. You understand? She basically just want to take this man, you know, to different 
fancy restaurants, you know, restaurants with very, very steak, you know, very, very expensive steak, very, very, you know, like very famous, notorious restaurants with five-star Michelin, you know, places like that. She wants to take this guy for a ride to all the, all the fancy restaurants, okay? You could tell immediately this girl's not interested in this guy at all, okay? Not at all. See, I, can you imagine, okay, let's say you saw a beautiful woman, right? She's beautiful, she's sexy, and she's funny, right? And for some reason, you don't want to eat her food. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine you saw a beautiful girl that you really like, but then you just don't want to eat her food? Does that make any sense? No, it does not make any sense. If this girl is interested in this man, right, she would have no problem eating this guy's food, okay? Because if you really find this guy, if you really find this man very charming, you know, he could be your soulmate, you guys could be, you know, together for a long time, then why don't you try this, why, why cannot, why can't you try this man's cooking? Why not? Just eat his food, right? This is the second date. This is not the first date, right? I understand first date, if you treat a woman to your house for some food, yeah, that's kind of disrespectful, you know, because it's like... Well, it's like, what the fuck you think I am? You think I'm homeless? You think I'm homeless? Like, you think I don't have food to eat? No, right? If this is our first date, you should take me to a, you know, a decent restaurant, right? Or maybe for a drink, maybe take me to a cafe and, you know, drink something where, you know, at least a decent restaurant where if you're, if you're poor, take me to a, you know, a drinking date, right? To a bar or something. But this is the second date, right? I know the guy changed his mind. The guy... The guy uh, wanted to take her to a Capitol Grill, right? Promised to take her to Capitol Grill, but then changed his mind and decided, you know what? I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna cook for her, you know. So it's more romantic. See, guys think like that. I think like that too. I I'm a pretty good cook, so I I want to show off to to the girl my cooking, right? My cooking skill, right? But then you you saw he saw what happened, right? The girl is the girl does not appreciate that, you know. The girl wanted to eat out. This is a typical foodie call, you understand? The girl is not interested in this man. The girl only wants to wine and dine using this man's wallet. You know, she wants to eat at different restaurants. And this guy is a sucker. This guy is the sucker. He has to pay for that, right? Well, I, I don't know, man. I mean, but hey, you know what? I think this is a pretty good idea. And you know what? In fact, I'm going to do exactly what this man does, okay? If I ever meet a girl, right, on the second date, I'm going to take her home. I'm going to promise her, oh, I'm going to take you to a, a very expensive uh, Italian food or French food or something. You know, five-star Michelin, whatever. And then I surprise her. I take her home, you know? And I cook for her. And then I want to see how she reacts. If she she's like, hey... What's wrong with you? You're supposed to take me to a restaurant. Why do you want to cook for me right now? Why 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 am I eating your food? If if she reacts that way, I know, okay, I know she's not into me. I know she's into, you know, she's only she only wants to, you know, like take me out to different restaurants, so I'll treat her. Right? She basically dated she's basically dating dudes for restaurants, not for not for the dudes, you know? So well anyway, tell me what you think, man. Um, I guess I'll see you guys later. Have a nice day.